It, of course, is dairy month. It's also wheat cutting time mm -hmm. in Georgia as farmers are hard at work harvesting their fields. One local business using that fresh wheat to produce delicious and healthy baking products. Damon Jones has that story. While it might not be one of the most produced crops in the state, more than 300,000 acres of wheat was planted this past year. And one family in Cochran is taking that wheat from the fields right to the shelves. Welcome to Back to the Basics 101, where Ginger Butts is producing the freshest wheat flour you can buy. So my husband grows the wheat, and I take the wheat after he's cleaned it and bagged it. Then I take the wheat berries, and I go into the mill house and pour the berries in there, flip the switch, and it grinds between two stones and have stone ground whole wheat flour. This business started three years ago when the nutrition director for the Blakely County School System contacted her to see if she wanted to participate in the Feed My School for a Week program. From there, Butt's product expanded into other schools, giving the children a healthier option. Because I know that um, whatever has a shelf life is void of nutrients, and I know that when you mill wheat into flour, there's 35 to 40 nutrients that our bodies need, and these children may not be getting any kind of nutrients otherwise, so at least while they're at school, getting Georgia grown, fresh milled flour. I know those babies are getting good nutrition in them. It makes me happy. And now she's using that fresh flour to produce a full line of baking mixes. This idea came about after people who loved the product wanted a quicker, easier way to make whole grain goods. I took flour and people thought it was the, the coolest thing, but a lot of people don't do anything with flour. But they still wanted the healthy, um, but they want convenient and yummy all rolled into one and so I made up recipes and um, have bagged them into homemade baking mixes with directions and all they have to do is follow the directions and add the wet ingredients and they can have healthy, yummy, convenient in minutes. After starting off as just a hobby, Butts now has an online store to go along with the school systems she provides for. And she recently even partnered up with a well-known business in the central Georgia area. I've got a website, backtothebasics101.com. They can order online. They can come see me Thursdays at the market in Warner Robin. Um, my best seller is the fruit crisp. You can add apples or pears to it. Um, strawberry season just passed. You could add strawberries to it. And now peach season is upon us. And so Lanes will be having um, peach crisp and peach muffins and blueberry muffins and cornbread and whole wheat flour that they'll be selling at their um, store. Reporting from Cochrane, I'm Damon Jones for the Georgia Farm Monitor.